Okay, so I had all these extra parts laying around the house. I said to see if I could throw it together and make something work. So here we have an old PC power supply. And you just take the end and you have to jumper like the green and the black wire. Black should be ground. I don't know what the heck the green is. Power supply is something or other. Anyways, uh, that'll let the power supply turn on um, without being hooked up to a computer. Um, then you just grab one of your leads and on these uh, yellow yellow is going to be 12 volts and blacks are ground so I found a had an old cassette car stereo laying around so I just tapped into the wire harness and what you do is a yellow and a red off of a car stereo uh, I think yellow goes to battery and red goes to ignition so you hook those together and you tie it into a yellow lead on the power supply and then you just hook the blacks or ground so you hook those up and then just go look on the internet and see which uh, colored cable pairs front front right and front left speakers so I took those took some old speaker wire just used some uh, wire tie ends their electrical ties and then hooked them up to some old these are actually uh, I used to have a really nice, I think it was a JVC TV, and uh, anyways, those are the speakers left over from it. So I tied those into the car stereo, and then um, this st car stereo is really old. It's a cassette, and I don't have an antenna for it, so I actually have this old cassette adapter. So you just uh, set this side up, throw that in. Um, then I got an MP3 player. And that hooks into that cassette adapter, and I'm low on battery, so I just plugged it into the wall, and it's already on. So I turn on my power supply. You can hear the fan wind up. Then I'll turn on my car stereo, and the static you hear, if you can hear that, is because it's trying to pull FM. Let's see. So there, it's trying to run the tape. And so now I'll turn on my MP3 player. There we go. So, believe it or not, the whole thing works. So I'm thinking about putting it all together and making a nice uh, little stand for it and what I would like to do is find an old a newer car stereo and put a subwoofer on it and uh, really get the place rocking there uh, anyways that's it